Hey guys, Shokist here. Welcome back to a new video. So today I'm just covering some very important ARC news on ARC Survival Ascended that you need to know. So it's been officially delayed now until October. The original date was going to be around August or so, uh, but I'm now curious whether or not they will delay the wipe of the official servers until October as well, or they're just going to still wipe them in August. But I'm just going to jump straight into it with the most important information, guys, is that when Ark Survival Ascended does launch in October, there will be only one map available, and that will be the island. Also, which is super important, is we're not going to be able to transfer to the island map until the networking is done in December and the launch of Scorched Earth comes out. So that's going to change up a lot of things, uh, especially as ARC players, we're so used to transferring in and out of other maps and also transferring to other maps for PvP, which we're not going to be able to do that. So that's going to change the game up until December. They've also changed the price, guys, from $44.99 to $39.99 for purchasing uh, Arc Survival Ascended, which includes the Island, Scorched Earth, Aberration, Extinction, Gen 1 and 2, and all the three non canon maps like Falk and Rag and Center. I did also read a comment from a dev, but this isn't 100% confirmed. But uh, cryopods may not be a thing from the get go, which is basically going to change a lot of things and potentially bring back those really big land bases, even on just the island. So that's going to be pretty interesting. But I kind of want to hear your guys' thoughts on whether or not you guys want cryopods from the get go or not. So just drop a comment below and let me know. Also, another thing which is confirmed is that there will be cross-platform play uh, from day one. So right away, that console and PC uh, can play with each other, which is going to be really awesome. They also did say that premium mobs won't be available until the end of the year. I'm not 100% sure what that means, what premium mods do. Uh, if you guys do know, uh, write in the comments. But uh, which I think it is, is is to do with like the unofficial servers uh, but they did say that they will be coming out at the end of the year so that will be released when Scorched Earth comes out. You will also get to see gameplay guys close to the launch so you will be able to make like an informed decision whether or not that you want to buy Ark Survival Ascended or not um, but you know all us ARC players that put thousands and thousands of hours into the game I'm sure it's going to be worth it and I'm sure we're going to end up buying it no matter what. Plus, you know, a fresh wipe is going to bring a lot of fresh PvP. Uh, not being able to transfer from each island to island is going to be interesting for a few months until the, the SE comes out and we can transfer there. Uh, it also said that they are going to be slowly releasing the other maps as well as they're getting finished, remastered. So I'm sure more maps will be coming out, but it does seem to take some time to uh, change it to Unreal Engine 5. So to sum up guys, uh, just a TLDR, SE and uh, transfers will be coming in December uh, and the only map available will be island at launch without transferring to it. So we'll be making more videos on the island like the best spots to build, where to get your flag BPs, where to get all your resources. So when ARC 1.5 island does come out, you know everything you need to know. It's also going to be super crazy if they do disable cryopods on launch until it comes out with extinction like it did with the original game. If they do this, which I think they should, because it will be a lot more fun because people will build more land bases. Because whenever anyone builds in a cave, attacking a cave was never really that fun. It's always just such a hassle, they're so strong, half the dinos don't fit into the caves, it's just annoying. Anyways, it's going to be really interesting, that's for sure. And again, I want to hear your thoughts on cryopods, so please let me know below in the comments section. And thanks a lot for watching. Peace.